Hello everyone, this is a new brain test for you today. Okay, we need to find this answer. We have 10 minus 10 times 10 plus 10 and plus 0 factorial. Right here we have a lot of options. We have A, B, C and D. So right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself real quick. And after like 30 minutes we will check our answer. It will be the same or not the same. Okay, I want to start with this obvious mistake. Okay, we start with this subtraction. So this is the case that I don't want to recommend you. If you start with this subtraction, this is our first case. If we subtract 10 minus 10, we have 0. And we left with 10, so 0 times 10, plus 10, and also as we have on the, as the left, and plus 0 factorial. Okay, if we multiply 0 times 10, we have 0. And 10 plus 0 factorial, we know that 0 factorial equal to 1. So 10 plus 1 equal to 11. So as you can see, we don't have this option right here. Why we don't have this option? Because this is a wrong approach and I don't recommend this approach. Forget this approach, forget this method to solve it because we cannot start this, this solving this problem with subtraction and of course with addition. How can I solve it? So this one is incorrect. So this one is incorrect. But how can we solve this problem correctly? We need to start with multiplication. So we need to start with multiplication and division. Okay, let's start with this. And of course, we, if we don't have any parentheses, let's start with multiplication. So we have 10 at first in the beginning. So 10 minus and 10 times 10. What it will be equal? It will be equal to 100. So 10 minus 100. And we left with plus 10 and plus 0 factorial. Okay, we have this expression. This expression is absolutely correct because we start with multiplication or division. In our case, we have multiplication. So in our case, this method is absolutely, absolutely correct. But let's find our final answer. What do we have? 10 plus 10, it will be 20. So as a result, we have 20 minus 100. And we need to know about 0 factorial. 0 factorial equal to, equal to 1. So just learn it, just remember it, that 0 factorial equal to, equal to 1. This is the rule that we really need in our case. And let's find our final answer. We have 20 minus 100. We all know that this will be equal to minus 80. And plus 1 in the end. The classic school rule right here, the basic rule, minus 80 plus 1, it will be minus 79. This is our our answer. What do you think about this? Write uh, in a comment your answer if the same or not the same. Uh, your option is C or not. C. It will be really interesting to read about it. And thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this brain test. Don't forget to follow my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. And write something down in a comment. I really appreciate it as well. Thank you and have a great day.